twin flames welcome into your weekly forecast so let's take a look at your energy between you and your twin flame and see what's coming towards you this week whether this is physically whether it's spiritually for some of you guys it's going to be both all right make sure that you are also subscribed to your areas only placements love tarot anywhere areas is in you or your person's chart any third party karmic attachments as well you will resonate with those messages over there cafe astrology.com will also always be linked below for you to help you out with any placements all right somebody here has gotten enlightenment they know y'all are really true fucking true twin flames all right all right, the energy is also fluent. It will um, fluctuate back and forth between you and your person. These are general timeless readings. Just take what is yours, leave what is not for you, okay? It is for somebody else that is here. All right, let's see what is going on. That's just for the collective, for the weekly forecast for the Twin Flames. All right. We can be friends, me and your friends, every other weekend. All right, this is some, um, somebody here wants to, like, double date with you. That's a verse from P. Diddy and the Taurus B.I.G. You don't need nobody else. One more chance. Yeah. All right. The Ten of Pentacles. This person wants one more chance. Somebody here wants one more chance. It's like we could double date. We could hook up. We could be, fr be friends then. We could do this every other weekend. Come to my house. Come. I'll come to yours house. Um, But there's a block here. Okay. So you could also like be ignoring them or some shit like that. The strength card. Yep. Somebody here is trying to get their strength back with you or their strength up to like reconnect with you. One more chance. Give me one more chance. This person wants one more chance with you because you leave leaving ass out in the cold fire of the pentacles. This could be vice versa. Um, you have the six of swords. I don't know who this. Your person likes big dogs, big animals. Someone here could have like a king corso or some shit. But they want one more chance. They feel this in their spirit. What else is popping up for you? Look at that. The lover's card. The full card. There's a lot of yellow. Someone here has been humbled by the spirit from. That's right. 606 is that start your message. So this is... Um, and God showed itself. Someone here has been talking to God. This could be someone here that is praying about taking another chance with you. One, and one more chance with you. A new cycle of partnership. They want to come together. Um, somebody here wants to date you. Somebody here also kind of want to see what their friends take is on you. Damn, three cards popped out for you, the devil. Somebody here is obsessed. Three of swords and a six of cups. But there's a broken heart um, that's involved in the past or some kind of past has led to, like, you guys being broken hearted and they know this or some shit like that. Geminian, Aries, Aqua, Aries, Energy, Capri on Libra and Scorpion. Yeah, so that's why you're so guarded. Yeah, but they really want, to, want you to accept the offer. They really want to make an offer to you secretly, for real. So you might not know how this person feels. Yep, they want to reach out. Somebody here wants to text you. I just saw the messenger card. Yep, this could be on the um, web, on the internet, on the world web. Um, I just saw a messenger. Child, yeah, I ain't gonna lie, child. Yeah, sex is expected and wanted. Someone here feels like y'all need to have sex, though. Because it would leave you guys, like, something to kind of... I, I don't know if this is to think about each other or to keep you guys, like, holding on. Yep, they do. They feel like sex will be... Oh, so very nice. But when they make this offer, they want you to be open up and sweet. And this is somebody that's coming to stay tonight. Somebody here wants to come tell you how they feel and stay tonight or they're going to. And this is somebody here that's going to pack a little ass bag. And somebody here, when they come over, oh, yeah, they uh, bring, they, they going to have a little bag. It's like, damn, did you have this plan? They did. Or they was highly, like, um, hoping Mm. Geese, bravery, a risk. Someone here, I, I said this. Somebody here is familiar. Um, is a is a different animal than what you're used to. That's what makes familiars kind of cool. It's a geese. 
Okay, um, for some of you guys, you might hear geese, you might see geese when this person is around. Also, um, this is somebody that wants to like um, keep a picture. Somebody here also, somebody here wants you back. And, they, and somebody here, you know how you go to the club and you have little pictures of like you and your friends, like on your little, around your TV, on your little stand, on your dresser or whatever. They want a picture of you and them up there. Yes, they do. But this all starts with you taking them off block. We're going to have to see what the block is. Someone here feels like you're still mad. You're still holding on to a grudge, whether it's you and them, but they are past that. Maybe they don't feel like you are, but they're trying to figure out how to let you know that they want to let it go. They want to move forward. They feel this. Their spirit team is like, could be giving this person a yes. We're going to see what their ancestors' uh, familiars. I just saw my familiar deck, so we're going to pull that and see what they have um, showed this person, told this person. Um, 6016. I'm also seeing 6376. 6736 as well. So let's see what's going on. Well, let's pull an angelic number and go a little deeper. All right, guys. You see a lot of sixes from this person because this person is being humble. Y'all, yep. they want to communicate. They feel spared. They also feel spiritually. This Your twin flame feels spiritually connected to you. Yeah. Okay. So angel number six. 736. Six. This angel number means you have a chance to focus your mind on creating positive changes in your life and manifest your deepest desires. Yep. This person is going towards positive change and they want to manifest things deep with you. This can even be sexually. And I got to say this, this is a twin flame that no, um, these group of twin flames know they broke your heart. You're disappointed. You're still mad and or holding grudges. What's the seven of one? That's why they have to be brave and take a risk. Before I, I get that, they definitely want me to grab the familiar deck. This is one of the familiar decks I like to use. All right. What's the seven of wands? Sanctuary's energy here. What's this? Yep, strategy. <laughs> so they got a strategy around the seven of wands. Yep, a change. Um, someone here wants to change some things up. They're going to change what they're used to doing. This could be someone here that maybe are willing to do things that they're not used to doing. What's the seven of wands? What's the seven of wands? Damn. Damn. Snake and the truth. You feel snaked by this person, but they know you know the truth. Someone here knows, has already know that you know, like, maybe how they snaked you in the past, what went down in the past, or some shit, shit like that. And Cinder Masters 44 could also be gotten this person. Yup. And that's what you're holding on to. So, they are, um, they want to, like, offer some kind of companionship? So, they know you know, like, what's this? Songless. Yeah, in reverse. So they just don't know what to say. They don't know what could, uh, what harmony, melodies, or vibrations you guys could form together to make this okay. What's the snake? Hold on. Yup, the truth. They lied. Yup, they did. Somebody here lied. So this is somebody here that lied and blocked you first, and they could have did this for sex or whatever their own sexual motive was. You could have felt like somebody had sex, yep, and they walked off. Someone here got what they wanted, and sex or whatever, and they walked away. And, and this is your damn twin flame. That's what she said. And this person knows you're aware of this, but what, what the thing is, is they want to come back. I don't know if this twin flame thought they was never going to come back to their twin flame. Yep, Six of Pentacles, they want to offer you something. And this is somebody here that knows that they gonna, it's going to take them. They're going to have to pay what they weigh. This time they might be open. I told you they might even want to give you something, but they feel like you kind of deserve it because of how they did you. Yep, you were kind of Queen of Pentacles. You was maybe innocent in this or something like that. They've been waiting at a distance. Yeah, didn't I say that? Yep, Queen of Pentacles, yeah. So you were innocent? Mm. 
Okay, what's the Six of Swords? What's the Six of Swords? Oh. Oh, shit. The Ace of Wands. This person here is is still very much attracted to you. Yep, I knew I was going to see the Five of Wands. Yeah. So, it's like coming towards you, but they feel like, okay, they know that y'all going to have to get through this little hurdle. That's what I heard. Yep, this hurdle. Whatever in the past, Twin Flames. But here they go. The Joker still taking that chance. Um, and they already, they know you probably going to be ignorant. Someone here is already expecting you to be kind of cutthroat. They already expect you to say some old crazy shit. Yep, three of swords. Because they know you're hurt. This is a twin flame. Yep, queen of cups. They know that you're hurt. Yeah, they already know. Five of swords. They have already figured this out. They already know this in the five of cups. Yep, that you are disappointed. But so are they. What's the three of swords? Three of Swords. Mm. Oh, the tower. Yeah. And that's what it ended up being a tower for this person. Because they did. I, look at this. Two of Swords and the Ace of Swords. I don't know. I don't. I feel like this is a twin flame that felt like they was going to be gone. They did because they had they were getting attention from other people. Now they want success and victory with you. But I feel like this is a twin flame. They already knew they was going to be gone, be out of there. And I don't know if this person ever respected or returning. It's like they didn't care or some shit. They could have just left like, okay, all right, that's my twin. So what? I got what I want and I'm over. They didn't expect. Someone here is learning like what it means when it comes to feelings, emotion, authentic being authentic in truth which runs hand in hand and being authentically in your truth is really really like a, a a very powerful portal and force that you guys share and can have and they see that now but they already played this fucked up card or something yep the king of swords now they're now they're juggling trying to figure this out what's the devil oh damn hold on yeah queen of coins queen of pentacles they're obsessed with you and there's something about your energy, your pur pur your like pureness. Maybe you just healed from the shit and said, I'm going to do what I got to do, live with myself up. I'm cool, whatever. I just got to keep pushing. I just got to keep moving. You guys are sending each other rainbows. Yep, y'all are. Yeah. And you, it could have left you juggling for a while, but you did. Yep, you did. It paid your swords, but you became very clever. This person is watching you. They are. Oh, and then that's when it was real for them, too. That's when it was real for them, too. What's the Six of Cups? Y'all, that's your confirmation. Damn, I almost got scared, child. What's the Six of Cups? That's what you said. What's the Six of Cups? Yep, the five of ones. So now they were they want to fight for this, or it's like, what is this? What we got to figure out here? We got to figure out some shit here because, you know, I want this, you want this. Yep, judgment is being called. So they're calling judgment because they got love for you. This is somebody. This, this is what I don't always question about twin flames that I never understand. Like at first, how don't you love your twin flame? Like, or how don't you think you're going to have these feelings or you just going to control? That's you. That's the other part of yourself. Feminine or masculine. You got to be, I mean, really let that shit sink in. And I think somebody is just like realizing this on another note. You got to be a strong motherfucker to be able to like really do, like you do this like and not care or not feel like you're going to have affection and love. Really? Really? Let's see how that turns out for you. And that's what's happening, not to sound cocky. You got to love yourself enough to, yup. Oh my God. That's what she said. And because you love yourself, you have the opportunity to love them. And that's when that frequency comes into play. I love you enough to let you go. I don't want to continue to hurt you or us live or whatever you said, honey. You done with the fucking Maya Angelin on the mother. That's what she said. Damn. Okay, what's the strength card, child? They love it. Leo, now they in love. Maybe they never experienced this, but you that's your twin flame. Yep, the sun card. Now they praying to God, baby. Hold on. What else is here? They praying to, to the most high, and God is speaking to this person. Yep, king of cups. Yeah. Child, they cried. This person cried. Yep, they did. Because they started losing y'all's frequency somebody here y'all frequency is is not in the in the like queen's energy anymore it's in the night y'all the world card yeah damn 
and this cycle really yup got this person fucked up now they wondering like are you with somebody else are you giving this frequency this uh circuit this connection of frequency vibration to somebody else a new person and someone here feels like they know your type so someone that's like them yup and that and that it's fucking with them the ten of wands I just don't be understanding why that is. I just don't, baby. Oh, wait a minute. They're showing me my um, smaller cards. So let's take a look at that. All right, these ones we are rocking with. Sorry, guys. Y'all know how we work. I'll be happy to see what they be want me to go next. Okay. <laughs> All right, so we rocking with these. Okay, what else is going on here? What else? They don't want to throw this history away that you guys have. No, they don't want to throw this away. Oh, they don't. Um, yeah. Oh, child. Stork energy. Now, for some of you guys, this could be someone here that wants, like, a baby with their twin flame. Not necessarily a child, but with you, it's like, they, yep, they do ladybugs. They do. Um, someone here, they're aware of, like, who you are. They wonder what the child will look like more. You're sad more than this person is dreaming of you. Oh, That's my what she said. gosh. Damn, the love was good. Do y'all love when I do my hair? Now, um, this is somebody that know y'all gonna have haters. And at the end of the day, y'all might have to mix families. You see how this baby in the store court looks different from all the other storks? Okay, so there's a mixing of family, children, empress. And someone here is familiar as a pig? Get out of here. This is a group of twin flames that will familiars, usually when it comes to familiars, there's basics. But when it comes to like twin flames is when you will start seeing like a lot of different familiars. Because, you know, twin flames, especially how archies come from different frequencies, so they're able to connect to different animals. And you will see certain people like, damn, they got a pig as a pet. How? That's how. Mmm. Okay, guys, um, let's see what this person wants to say to you. All right, we're going to rock with these ones. Okay. Let's see. Some of you guys, your person could wear, like, feathers or certain shit like that in their hair. A lot of spiritual, um, awakened, like, people do that, um. You will see a lot of spiritual people. Um, some that are celebrities that are spiritualists do that. Child, was that lightning? Okay. It's storming outside. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is Helen coming in. Mm. Um, big egos would lead this relationship to a darker place. See, you didn't kill this person's ego. They already let that shit go. Look, let's just let her egos go, babe. Yeah, no. that's what she said. Let's just, you know. Let this shake up. Open your heart a bit more. Things are not as bad as you perceive. Wherever you guys were at, this person is no longer there. They're ready to move on, heal from that, and they want to reconnect. Um, no doubt you are the one and only I want to spend the rest of my lifetime with. There's this is a group of twin flames that knows the twin flame understands their frequency. I don't think they understood their frequency. And I got this is a group of twin flames that never thought. I, it's, you know, that, oh, I don't care if they're my twin flame or not. You know, I'll do this. I don't give a fuck. I don't love them. You got to understand what that really means when you say shit like that. And now they, they're seeing it or they know it. They're getting enlightenment on it of what it really means to really be a twin flame and how sacred it is to have a twin flame. So, and some twin flames can be total opposite and like, but exactly the same. The same things that make them different are the same things that makes them the same, if that makes sense. I don't even know how to explain that. Like, y'all share the same likes, and you can, in the world, they have another way of showing you it or doing it, and then you have a whole nother total way of showing and doing it, and together it's beautiful. It's like going through life with each other. They want to, somebody here wants to experience that. Now that they're starting to understand and they know. Child, what you going to do, child? Let's see this person's true emotions. I don't know what you going to do, child. What's their true emotions here? 
Yep, illumination, truth, discovery, and awakening. There's, this is a, a group of twin flames is woken up here. Your counterpart is woken up. Yep, to the truth. True colors. They see you clearly. It's like I, I, it's like clear as day. They know the same things that make you mad make them mad. The same thing that broke your heart end up breaking their heart. It's like, oh my gosh, this is my motherfucking. This is really my twin flame. Like somebody here is like, this is my real motherfucking twin flame. <laughs> and then they miss you. Yup, they had awakening to who you are. Period. And they missing you. And they feel like they missed out. I don't know if this is somebody that wasn't ready. I don't know. I feel like a lot of people know about the twin cl twin flame journey, but don't know of. This is somebody that might have knew about it and didn't give a fuck, whatever. I don't give a fuck about that shit. And then, all of a sudden, it's a true emotions. Now they want to experience it. They want to connect. Yeah. Fake busy. They feel like you fake and busy, child. <laughs> they feel like you fake and busy, honey. Like, nah, you ain't busy. You gonna talk to me, goddamn it, y'all. Look at this, Queen B, secure, confident, boss, bitch, and, uh, and career focused. Someone here feels like they they know you busy, but bitch, you ain't that busy. That's what this person wanna say. You ain't that motherfucking busy, child. You ain't too busy for me. We twins. Don't act like you don't know it now. Don't act like nah, we nah, uh, uh. You ain't letting me go. You must have lost your motherfucking mind. Yo, they keep running. This is, now, if you want to know, this is a clear case of that runner, chaser, pusher, pull energy between twin flames. Some of you guys need to look it up because this is exactly what the fuck is happening. Yep. And now this is turning into reckless love. Yep. Now that you guys are apart. Secluded. Well. All right, let's get a love oracle. Then we'll get some universal messages. Get a little universal tea on that. Okay, yep, test it. Obstacles. Your twin flame was being tested by the universe. It said, okay, that's how you feel. All right, you got it. And it's like something must have smacked their ass right in, 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 in their like head or something. And it just woke them up. What It helped woke them up. This is a lot. Yeah, seven of coins. Yeah, someone here, it's like they had to spend some time without you. Now they're deeply um, affected by you. There's a lot of confusion that this person got to clear up to because of what they didn't give a fuck. Or that's how they made it seem even when they started to care. We got, they got to take their power. This is someone here that's real intense. Your person here is a little edgy about this union. They could be really intense. You need to be careful because someone here like to break shit, punch holes in the wall, throw and break phones. These are things that could have been happening when you guys were separated. Um, yep. When y'all were separated in this connection. Yep. But they love you. I, I, this is a love. This love had came over. This, this person couldn't experience this with you around. It's like they had to go through what they had to go through. God had to show they ass. And even if they copy, the sauce wouldn't be the same. You could have like an escort or a stripper trying to copy off your energy. Um, this could be someone here that was talking to somebody that was trying to imitate you or something like that. Okay. Hold on, y'all. All these cards flipped over. Alright. What is... The universal messages. Show me the universal messages for the collective. What's the universal messages? I test people and send people to you. This is someone here that will test somebody. Call them and see if they answer the phone. Call them and see what they say. Call them and see if they'll talk to you. Because they ask this block the van, which this person knows who you are, your healer. And no one can copy you. Nobody. Not even this stripper or motherfucking escort. I can't make it up, child. Damn! I'm good. Look at this shit, child. They want to come back. This is someone here that said, I'm not, they, don't, they no longer want to come back. If they are coming back. Child, I don't know if I'm supposed to tell you like this or shit. Okay? That's what she said. This is somebody here, I'm um, hope. They hoping that it's going to go smooth. But sometimes it might get a little rough because they in their feelings, honey. This person's in their feelings. They're hoping and they're wishing and, you know, stuff like that. Yup, magic. And this could be someone here that's using, like, this is, like, their own magic to make shit happen. Also, with their friends calling you and shit, trying to reconnect. You know, ever hear that, you know, uh, term, you got to use your magic. They're using their alchemy. Yep. 
breaking free. Cause you've been break free. You didn't broke free. You didn't walked away. I don't. I don't think your twin flame was like expecting that or something. And they was like, "Fuck it. I don't give a fuck. I'll just replace them." Mm, nah, not really. <laughs> That's what they had to find out. Not so much. I don't think so. Okay. I don't think so. All right. What's what's up? What's up? Um. Thank you. Healing. Here it is. And you guys could be a group of twin flames that are light workers. Okay? But you bring the light. Yep. Yep. Free spirit. You are a free spirit. Yep. This could brother this person. Yep, it does. They're in their feelings about this. And the kind of spirit you are. Your person knows they know you because of who you are, but you know, they also kind of been studying you too. Damn. And because y'all share a lot of the same shit. We got the 11th house. Yeah, this person hasn't gotten to another partnership. Geminian energy. Here come communication. Or they tried to replace you with another partnership. And they didn't think they would give a fuck. They didn't think it would matter. That shit changed quick and fast. Honey, we in a new world. <laughs> it's just... Is what it is. We are in the great motherfucking awakening. Motherfuckers is waking up. We got Sagittarius. Okay, let's see what other card fell down here, child. We got Pisces, Twin Flames. We have Caprion, Twin Flames here. Okay. And we have Gemini and Twin Flames. Yeah. And some of you guys, you they want me to remind you that you're not just Twin Flames by your sun sign. It's also Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. Woo. Sorry, guys. You know when I channel, I do hiccup. I love you all. I hope this helps you out in more than one way. You got a Twin Flame that is um, wanting to reconnect. They plan on coming back. So you got some decisions to make. And there's some conversations that's going to take place. Don't forget to hit that like button. Hit that bell. Hit all that will keep you tapped and tuned in. And you will be notified when your messages are ready and available for you guys. Stay dope, Twin Flames. Next video upload. I'll share name mine.